In this video, I'll be seeing if I can make thermite using aluminum foil. So the first thing I need to do is to get the foil and make it into a powder. What I'll be doing is trying to cut it into strips and then throwing that in the blender and we'll see if that works. Alright, so here's as small as I can get the aluminum foil using the blender, and I decided just to throw it in a mortar and see if I can grind it up to get it even smaller. So using the blender didn't seem to work, it made the foil kind of scrunch up and then become very difficult to get any smaller. So I decided to tear off the foil into small pieces, roughly 1-2 to two centimeters in length and width, just so that maybe if they rub together some residual powder might kind of flake off. I feel like this might work better than having to turn the dense pieces from the blender into a powder.
Okay, so if you want to make thermite using aluminum foil, it is possible, but it's not going to be an easy task because to turn the aluminum foil into a powder without like a coffee grinder or something better than a blender, it's going to be pretty difficult. What I had to do is, I, as you can see in the video, I tore it into little chunks and then I put it in a mortar and I grinded it up for a long time and just barely recovered any powder at all, but it was just enough to test it out with iron oxide and yes, you can make thermite with it. So. It's possible, but a coffee grinder would probably be more ideal. And that concludes this video.